Hello everyone, this is Nisi from Kukuri Japan. Today we are going beyond the basics. I'll show you how to use Gemini's extensions and gems to save time and make your work easier by automating tasks. Now, to, are you automating any work with AI? Not really. I have heard it's possible to do something, but I'm not sure what can really be done. Oh, indeed. It's quite hard to imagine, right? But whether you work in sales, manage project, or just want to save time, this video has easy examples that will change how you use Gemini with Google Workspace. Let's get started. All right, let's start with the extensions. You type Artmark in Gemini and you can instantly pull in info from tools like Google Calendar, Drive, and Gmail. But here's the thing, using these extensions one by one doesn't show this little power. Sure, you can say Atmark Drive, find my list of B2B customers, but honestly, wouldn't it to be quicker to just search in Drive yourself? It's true. I have never found a reason to search a Gemini, honestly. Mm -hmm. Okay. The real magic happens when you chain extensions together. That's how you transform Gemini from a simple chatbot into your personal AI agent that handles multi-step tasks from a single prompt. Let me show you what I mean. Imagine you just finished a client meeting. Instead of manually digging for notes and drafting an email, watch this. At my calendar, find when was the last meeting with Naruto. At my drive, summarize what was discussed in the above meeting. At my Gmail, draft an email with reminders to from above meeting. Just like that, Gemini got to work. It pulled the meeting date from my calendar, found and read the meeting notes in Drive, summed up the action items, and even drafted a polished follow-up email in Gmail, ready to send. And the best part, you can save this entire workflow as a gem. The next time you just type the client's name, and boom, an instant follow-up email. Yes, mm. that sounds more like a future way to work. Yes, Naruto, you should give it a try. So now let's talk about Jam. Think of them as your personal library of saved prompts. You set up a workflow once, save it as a gem, and reuse it anytime. They are perfect for repeat tasks like daily reports, project updates, or meeting summaries. But here's a real game changer with Gems. You can attach live documents like a Google Sheets or Doc. This means Gemini is always pulled from the most up-to-date version of that file. Other tools might only work with static PDFs, but Gemini is different. When your sales number update in the sheet, it analyzes updates instantly too. For example, you can attach your team's sales tracker sheet to a gem. Live documents? Mm -hmm. oh, honestly, I can't imagine what we can do with it. Oh, no worries, Naruto. Let me show you. For example, here's how you set up a gem. Open Explore Gem in Gemini and click New Gem. Give it a title, then in the instruction box, type in the daily task you want it to handle. The key part is knowledge. Here, you can add documents from your drive. If your team keeps updating Joe's files in drive, Gemini will always use the latest information to generate answers based on your prompt. For example, analyze this sheet, report on the top deals, and summarize the key priorities. Gemini will instantly break down the deal status highlight the biggest opportunities, and flag risks for your managers. It's like a daily briefing, fully automatic. Mm. Wow. And even if you update the files in Drive, mm -hmm. Jim will read them and give you a fresh summary with the newest information. Exactly, that's amazing. Now, what if you want to visualize that report? With the Canvas feature, you can transform Gemini's text output into a clean. 
interactive dashboard with filters and graphs. And here's a pro tip for consistent branding. If you already have a layout you like, you can give Gemini the HTML structure. Just add the instruction, match the layout to this HTML, then paste in the code. You get clean on-brand dashboards with live data every time. Ready to try this? First, make sure your extensions are enabled. For workspace admins, you will need to go to your admin console and enable generative AI apps. For users, just click the settings icon in Gemini, go to extensions, and turn on tools like Calendar, Drive, and Gmail. If typing Atmark doesn't show any apps, you might need to ask your admin to enable them. The real power of Gemini isn't just asking questions, it's about combining the extension in smart ways, saving Joe's workloads as gems, and linking them to live sources of knowledge. I really felt today's use case sounds like the AI power mm -hmm. I always was dreaming for. Yes, Naruto, that's how you turn Gemini from an AI tool into your own custom smart assistant. If this video was helpful, please like and subscribe. See you next time.